On Wednesday afternoon, Assemblymember Nancy Skinner and Berkeley local business owners gathered to protest the effect of the governor's veto on the legislature's proposed budget. It's long overdue. Um, we've been arguing for years that this is not, as is characterized by the Republicans, a new tax. Just take a stroll down Solano Avenue. It's a mile long. You'll see vacancies on every block. This is unheard of on Solano. Businesses are, I know two restaurants that are going to go out of business this summer. They can't help it. And it's hard to signal to your customers that you're going out of business, but I know because of my contacts with them. There are businesses all over Solano that are suffering, and we're not alone. This is true of every other merchant community in Berkeley and in Albany. So meanwhile, we have our wonderful businesses on streets like Solano, streets like Shattuck, streets like San Pablo, or other any other street in AD 14 that are paying their property taxes, employing people, paying payroll taxes, paying their sales tax, and the governor completely turned his back on them. And he said he's protecting Overstock.com, a Utah-based company. This is Paul Edison from The Daily Californian.